Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Nino Kuni with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all those cool things. Oh, wait, that's the end. I need to do this at the beginning. Um, last time we left off, we had just defeated all the boneheads, but we're still looking for the banana gnaws all over the place. What is that? Okay, that's not a banana gnaw. I need to find the little guys that look like a banana and capture one so that guy can do his research. What he wants to do the research on, I don't know. I, I, I kind of skipped through his dialogue. Didn't really care. It was a task, and I'm like, yeah, I'll do the task. Whatever, dude. I'm down. It's got to be a good guy, right? Only good guys give task. Oh, please, please, please. Yeah. Okay. How do we serenade these guys? Let's go! Do we have to... Let me get a little guy out here. I'll just do little hits. Little hits. Oh, I killed him. Dang. Even the monkey's too strong. What's the little shield that's around him? Maybe I'm... I'm is that because he's got a badge? Or something? I don't know. I'll have to read what the auras are. Banana dudes. What are the banana dudes? Okay, is that a, nope, that's a bonehead. Did I just see that guy appear out of nowhere? No. I wish we could run faster. Oh, did I just run into him by accident? Oh! Light Let's go. shade. That's a new one. Uh, go get him, Jason. Do a water bomb on Oh, smacked him in the face! Come on, get it, get it, get it. Nice. Nice work! Nice work. GG. What's the difference between Oliver and Esther? Like, which one's saying it? I don't know. So, wait, if uh, Oliver starts dating Esther in this world, does that mean he's dating Mildred in the other world? <laughs> Better yet, would they get jealous of each other? <laughs> and, if this world consists of other world things, like, where's mine? Shouldn't I have an avatar as well? For a, a, a secondary person? Let's Somebody go. represent me in this world? These are the questions that keep me up at night. Well, you can get to capture him on that one. We won! I wonder if we're just gonna spend this entire episode trying to get these bananas. He did say the one that looks like an unripe banana, right? Not the one that looks like a ripe banana? What if that's the guy that we're supposed to get up there? It's like a boss fight. Um, how do I get up there? Hold on. Hold on. Is there... Oh, dude, you, like, outran me. Watch this! Okay, run away. Watch this. Run away. Nope. I need you. Get in there. <laughs> and he's like, I'm not messing with the sunshine. I'm going for this guy over here. <laughs> Dang, good, good effort. Maximum effort. <laughs> Come on. How do I get up to the top there? I think I have to go around, don't I? Those really do. They, they look like boss fights. I'm not sure that I should be messing with him, but I'm, I'm going to go for him. Okay. Looks like we can go up and around the outside here. Ugh, this is a long way to travel. Hello, Banana Man! You're just coming straight for me, huh? 
Green Buncher. We can do this! Now I think it's these guys I'm supposed to be capturing. He was not impressed. Because that's what it said when it gave the instructions. They're impressed. That's how you can serenade them. Can't go up there? Oh, what a sham. No. That was like the only way up. Come here, come here. Come here, banana bunch. What is, what is it called when a green buncher runs away? A <laughs> banana split. Um, hashtag dad jokes. <laughs> Neither one of them, huh? Alright, I'm done with this. Let's head towards the cove. Which is south, I think. Yeah, let's go let's go towards the cove. Uh before we do, start, save it. No more crashes. No more crashes. Da, da, da. Hello lampshade. Okay, run away, lampshade. That's fine. We can't go up the sides here at all. Hello, Lampshade. I'm gonna go straight for you. You're gonna run away. Okay. Going straight for you. Run away. We're not actually gonna fight them. We're just trying to scare them. Wait, can I go up this? <gasps> can I go up this? Yes! What are you? Can I defeat you? I think I might be going the wrong way. Ooh. We're under attack! Okay, these are some things that I've not seen before. Let's go ahead and cut loose. See how uh, how much damage we can do. Okay, not good, but not bad. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. We better get a lot of experience out of this. Same. Oh my god. Is that guy like a level up or something? That's not the same. That was like an evolved form of the first one. The tumblers. 110 experience points. Nice. Okay, so that's definitely a, a new um, type. Head over to Castaway and find yourself a ship. I think we need to go down through there. So let's let's do that. Let's not go someplace that we're not supposed to go yet. Although we probably could have gone around. We'll, we'll skip around here. We're not wanting to fight you. Come on, Mr. Drippy. Your little legs need to carry you faster. Right, Dolly Boy? <laughs> Come on, please, please, please. Let's do it! Here you go! No, didn't say anything that time. See, there's the first, first evolution of that turban, turbandit. We did it! That second one, that was something new, because it did not take, it, like, it took a lot longer to defeat him. <laughs> See, I feel like this kind of happened during Pokemon. Especially Pokemon Yellow. Wait, who are you? Are you a bad guy? What are you? Oh yeah, you're a bad guy. A pure Lino and a what? Wham bat. Okay. Oh, you do some damage, don't you? Alright. No match against us. The mighty adventurers. 64 experience points. So it's it's really not much difference than the stuff that we were already fighting. 
What is this? We got a whetstone. Nice. Okay, so they have to run into me. They can't run into Esther or Mr. Jippy, right? I'm just constantly hitting the X button. <laughs> Neato! All right, heading to the cove. Let's go. Hey, I leveled up. Jason leveled up. Dang, you leveled up. All right, uh, is there a map? Can I R1 this? All right, so that's where we're supposed to be going. Look, look, somebody's got a quest for us. Oh, I guess I could have just looked at the map to see if there was a, a way around to get to the top there. And it looks like right there might have been the way in. But then we'd have to go like all around the top there. Wait. Wait, what's that guy up there at the top left hand side? Hmm. This is a bigger map than I thought it was, isn't it? Wait, what's that over there? Is that a castle of some kind? Alright, go to the star code. Whoa, Swamp Rat! Or something. No, run away. We're running for our lives now. Hold on, where, where was that guy at? Yeah, we're not gonna do that yet. We're just, we're gonna go to the town. Go to the cove. Just get to the cove. Castaway Cove. Yay! Please be like a, a pirate town. Please, please be like a pirate town. Jeepers! <gasps> Castaway Cove. Haven of half-dressed harmony? What? <laughs> Stop! Thief! Huh? A thief? Where? Oh, there he goes. That man, he ran off with a huge pot. Come back here! You must pay! Someone has to stop him! It's daylight robbery! You're not going to let him get away with it, are you, Ollie boy? No way! We need to go after him! That's the spirit! Proper brave you are, man! No wonder you've passed those trials! Them trials! Hee <laughs> hee! I knew you'd say that, Oliver! Uh, let's chase down that criminal! Alright, come on! He ran down here, then I stopped for the pot, and I got 30 guilders out of it. Hello. Dude, you were like all over the place, aren't you? Looking for the people, and I'm looking for the thief. But I don't know where he went. There's another one. Got a little cupcake, and I'm running for it. Where is the guy? Is he gonna... Like most thieves, you know, they stop and wait for you. Not this guy, he just... Straight up took off, didn't he? Oh, you've got... Yep. We'll come back. We'll come back. I have a feeling he went this way. Oh, you got some too, don't you? Enthusiasm all over the place. Heart. Are you him? You're not him. What is that? Is that a little crab? Holy crab! Mr. Crabs. There he is. Dang it! There's no escape! Give back what you stole! What I stole? What are you on about? What you mean... <coughs> what do you mean, what am I on about? The great big pot, of course! Pot? Oh, this thing? What's wrong with him, man? It's like he doesn't even remember stealing it. <laughs> what do I want with this piece of rubbish? If you want it, it's yours. Ah! 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 I'm sure it will make you very happy. See ya! What, what the? What was that about? Why would he steal something and then just throw it away like that? 
Yes, why would he? What was he thinking? I don't reckon he was thinking at all, man. Huh? How do you mean? Well, he ain't bothered with... Uh, bothered what he's... He ain't bothered what he steals. It's just the stealing he's in it for, ain't it? You mean he enjoys stealing for his, its own sake? Yeah, that's about the size of it. I'm no expert, man, mind. If that's really true... Wait. If that's really true, he's even more horrible than I thought. Well, never mind that for a minute. Let's get the old pot back to the peddler, shall we? He must be worried sick, poor fella. He must be, huh? Okay, let's take it back to him. You obtain the particular pot. The peculiar. Peculiar. You obtain the peculiar pot. <laughs> wow. Come on. <laughs> That's right. I'm going to make the king of the fairies carry that for me. Uh, we went this way, then we went up the stairs, not stopping for the chest I just saw on my left. Going left now. My goodness, they are half dressed, aren't they? Jeez. Mm -hmm. Hey, buddy. Uh, excuse me, sir. I think this belongs to you. Oh, uh, indeed. Uh, you, uh, recovered it. Yes, we did. The thief got away, unfortunately, but we got your pot back for you. Curses. I, I mean, is that so? You, you have my thanks. Crikey, don't be too grateful, will you? It's not like flipping heavy or anything. Forgive me, it's just that... I was rather pleased to have finally be rid of it myself. <laughs> rid myself of it, huh? The man you chased. He is a habitual thief. He does not care what he steals. So, as ever, I called after him, Stop, thief! But when I saw what he had in his hand, I gave thanks to the agents. <laughs> you gave thanks for being robbed? In this instance, yes. You see, this pot, no matter how I try, it will not open. Therefore, I cannot use it to store my wares. It is, is no use to me. Yes, you must take it. Uh, for apprehending the thief, it's the least I can do. You're giving it to us? Just like that? Hold on a second! You just told us it's flipping useless, and now you're pretending like you're doing us a favor by giving it to us? What's going on, Mon? Um, uh, perhaps you think of me... Think of it as a souvenir of your visit to Castaway Cove. The Jewel of the Seven Seas. Um. <laughs> a souvenir? A great big pot like this? Yes, the most wondrous souvenir. It's no ordinary pot, after all. If if the rumors are to be believed... Okay, here we go. <clears throat> it was once used by the ancient royal family. It has an illustrious and regal history. But if that's too true, we can't accept it. It's too valuable. B but you must! I am so grateful. You're uh, so very grateful for your help. Think nothing of it. Go now. Take it. Go. Be gone. Uh, okay. <laughs> you said yes? <laughs> you said yes? What did you do that for, man? What do you mean, Mr. Drippy? Did I do something wrong? I mean, he looked he looked as if he was going to cry if we didn't take it. He seemed real worried. Indeed, I was worried. Wait, that's not Drippy. <laughs> Indeed, I was worried. I was worried that you would uh, think me ungrateful. Yes, that is it. I was worried about that. Thank you so much. Something funny is going on here. Come on, tell us. There's something wrong with the pot. What is it? R -r wrong? Why, of course not. It's simply the lid will not open. And perhaps now, again, spine-chilling chattery emitting from within. Now and again, a spine-chilling chatterings with emit from within. But only every once in a while. It's nothing. <laughs> so the lid won't open, but strange sounds come out from the inside of it. What could the, what could that be? What could that mean? 
Oh, this, sorry, this is drippy. <laughs> so that's it, is it? Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. Uh huh? You know why it won't open, Mr. Drippy? Nah, man. It'll open. You just have to know how, ain't it? It's a cauldron, see? Really? It. This is a cauldron? Wow. You know what that is? Yes, never seen one, but my father had one. All wizards have cauldrons, you see. Oh, great. Do we have another wizard thing? They do? That they do, Ollie boy. And the reason that it won't open is because it's sealed up tight with some powerful magic. But all it needs is for you to use some magic words written on the wizard's compendium and Alakazam. The lid will pop off just like that. It will? Huh? Oliver, you should try to open it. I should? R right now? Why not, Mon? There's no time like the present. Go on, give it a go. Uh, okay, some magic words within the wizard's compendium, huh? Let me just take a look here. Alright, so... Do you remember how to read your wizard's compendium, don't you, Ollie Boy? Sure I do. Oh, sure I do, Miss Ray. I just opened the main compendium, blah, 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 blah. Exactly! A budding wizard like you should be able to read the bit of... bit of that book every day, truth be told. Anyways, get and find the magic words, will you? We haven't got all day. Wait, do I have to go find it? But but the winter's convenience is kind of long. I mean, it could take me a while to find the right words. You don't have to read the whole thing, do you? Use your noggin. The magical words in for your alchemy cauldron will be in ch chapter under alchemy, ain't it? That means, I guess, I should start looking, huh? <sighs> well, um, <laughs> that's it for this episode. <laughs> So on Friday, what is this? Is this episode four? Yeah, so Friday, we will continue and we will read the compendium and get the words to open the cauldron. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Nino Kuni with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all the cool things that you're supposed to do at the end of videos, but you don't have to. That's just a call out to call, call to action. Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you very soon. Next episode, Open the Cauldron. Outro.